Okay, let's connect and talk about art as I reconnect my IFB here so I can hear what's going on. Okay, and you may have seen some really expensive paintings if you happen to eat at one particular casino. Yes, we're getting fancy today. You probably just thought they were knockoffs if you saw them, but no, they're actual Picassos worth more than a hundred million dollars. Look at wow. those babies. They were in the Picasso restaurant at the Bellagio Hotel and Casino in Las Vegas. They are dated from 1917 to 1969. So the bees will auction the pieces on Saturday, October 23rd. MGM got them when it bought the property from Steve Wynn. Do you think they knew how much those pieces cost? I mean, now they do. Hopefully whoever sold them knew. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah you're and right. I'll throw in the art with the yeah. hotel. <laughs> I know, but anything could be a Picasso. I feel like I'm very good at abstract art, cubism, these kinds of things. I think I could be really good at the Picassos. We're just going to call damn Picasso numero dos now. Because it's just not very... <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, I, it's very impressionistic, obviously. That's his style. Exactly. It's still special. Mm-hmm. But Dan Real could special. do it too. But Dan's special. <laughs> okay, Nobody let's check out what else is trending this morning. Okay, so someone posted a medical bill from their birth back in 1955. It's blowing up the internet. Take a look at your screen. It shows that it costs to deliver a child with a three-night hospital stay less than 60 bucks. Holy cow. Back in 1955. Wow. The good old days. The good, that, that's the good old days right there. <laughs> it was cheap, that's for sure. It was cheap. <laughs> yeah. But I'm going to get serious for a second. I looked up the mortality rates, the infant mortality rates from then to now. Yeah. And then it was 30.7 yep. per 1,000 births. Okay. And now it's 5.6 per 1,000 births. So the mortality rate has gone way, way down. Okay. So... It's more expensive, but it's a lot safer to have a baby now. Well, you know, back then, I don't think they had epidurals and all the Right, that's why it's getting more and more that's expensive, <laughs> you know, but also the, you know, the risk is a lot lower to the baby. And you know what, the comments are actually what really cracked me up, and it kind of goes along with that. Um, one user wrote, ha ha, my kid costs $12,000. Yeah. Thank goodness for insurance. Someone else wrote, C-section here, $40,000 later. Mm -hmm. And so there are these other ways about going about yeah, it. And so. that's when you let your kid know, you cost me 40 grand, you get in that car right now and get to school. Don't even think about throwing well, that tantrum. And that's just to start. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's the starting price is 40 uh, grand. Oh, it only goes up from there. All right, let's take a look at today's totally random poll. We're asking you at home, do you own vinyl records? Look how the results are changing. More Utahns are saying yes, 43%. 57% saying no, and I think it's so interesting, Ryan Rose wrote, they're becoming more popular. Again, my kids are in college, and they want a record machine for Christmas. So things are coming back full they're circle. They're trendy. It's they're like trendy. fashion. Yep. Low-rise jeans are coming back. They shouldn't. <laughs> Thanks, Danny. They shouldn't, says Danny. Okay, <laughs> now we, I'll stop wearing them.